going to learn how to make a volcano and learn about chemical reactions. What you will need to make a volcano is some vinegar in a cup, some food coloring, some dishwashing soap, some baking soda and a spoon. First, pour two drops of food coloring. I'm putting red. Then, get your spoon and mix it. And when you're done mixing it, pour some dishwashing soap. Now, let's put the baking soda. Today, we are going to do an experiment about chemical reactions. Here, we have some vinegar and baking soda inside the balloon. We will pour the baking soda in the balloon and see what happens. So pour it into the bottle. Whoa! So it's what happens is when the vinegar reacts with the baking soda, carbon dioxide forms and goes into the balloon, and that's what makes the balloon fill up and blow. Whoa. So the bubbles are carbon dioxide and this is vinegar with baking soda and this is all carbon dioxide in the balloon. the chemical reactions. Are you guys excited? Let's do our experiment. So what you will need for this experiment is some vegetable oil, vinegar, food coloring, and fizzing, fizzing tablets. tablets. Please have an adult next to you when you are doing this experiment for your safety. So first, add two or three drops of food coloring. Then, add some vegetable oil. Then, get your fitting tablets and drop them in. And see what happens. Whoa! They fit! So they fizz and wow! They go, the bubbles go up and come down. are a base and the vinegar is an acid so when they react they form carbon dioxide and it fizzes wow Ooh. so cool oh, so cool mm. also going up oh. and spraying mm. up so the vinegar is mixed with the vegetable oil with the food coloring and 
the fizzy tablets. Look at the blue. I'm gonna put another one and see what happens. Whoa! See what happens. Whoa! Whoa. It's a dense fizzy that shakes. And yeah, look at all those bubbles. It's so cool. Whoa! Wow. Oh. Wow. It's, it's like so cool. Some, some water is wow. binding up like sea volcanoes. Yeah. So no, now, now they're cool. rising up. Yeah, it's so cool. So cool! Look at all those green! And there's vinegar, some wow. fitting tablets, some food coloring, and vegetable oil. What so is that it's. Thing? it's uh, is it? Wow! So there's bubbles so jumping cool. up and down, and some bubbles are just staying there. Yeah, it's so cool! Wow! So cool! Oh my god, it's so cool! And it's keep on fizzing, and bubbles are going up and down, staying. The bubbles look like goo. Yeah. Wow! Now it's almost becoming as two layers like last time. Yeah. And now all the bubbles are dropping back to the green the level. Green level, the green. Whoa. One. So cool. Looks like this one is vinegar only. But and this one is the vegetable oil only. Wow. So, so cool. now again they're both separated in two levels because of density. So this Vinegar, the vinegar and with the, the food green food coloring is more, is more denser, denser so it sinks to the bottom. It's like sinking to the bottom. And the wow. vegetable oil is less denser, so it goes to the top and stays in a separate layer. Whoa, look at all those bubbles which are on the top. Whoa! Whoa. Cool. These oh. volcanoes erupt. 
day. These are no longer volcanoes. Now I'm gonna put some blue food coloring. Wow! There's just drops of food coloring going all around. They're not mixing. Wow! Now let's put another one with the blue food coloring. Wow! There's wow. a lot of bubbles rising up. There's bubbles. And there's it's, volcanoes over there. Yeah. It's kind of getting black. Yeah! So cool! Yeah. Whoa! That big volcano! Wow! It's so, so cool! Wow. Let's keep on fizzing. Yeah. Now there's blue volcanoes. Yeah. It's blue. Looks wow. cool in the dark. dark. It's like glow in the dark. Yeah, it's like, like a lamp. Keep on fizzing. It looks yeah. red at the bottom. Yeah, now it's red on the bottom and yellow on the top. That's kind of bubbles on the yellow a little. Now there's lots of bubbles going up and down. Yeah. And they're both still separate layers. Yeah, now. Mm -hmm. Now they're both separate layers because of the oil is less yeah. denser than the food colored vinegar. So the vinegar is at the bottom because it's more denser than and the, the oil. vegetable oil. Now let's learn about the chemical reactions that created the bubbles and inflated the balloon. So here we put baking soda and vinegar and when I poured the baking soda from the balloon into the vinegar they reacted and formed carbon dioxide and that carbon dioxide is the bubbles. Now we know how the bubbles came from. So now let's learn about the chemical names of baking soda and vinegar. So the chemical names of baking soda and vinegar is, for baking soda, it is sodium bicarbonate and for vinegar, it is acetic acid. So now let's learn about the formula of sodium bicarbonate or baking soda. So the formula is NaHCO3. So there's one sodium, one hydrogen, one carbon, and three oxygens. Now let's learn about the Lewis structure. So the Lewis structure is Na plus O minus OHCO. When there's one line between one or two atoms, that means that there's one electron shared with the atoms, like C and O. But if there's two lines, that means there's two electrons shared with O and C, like over here. Now, let's learn about the formula of acetic acid or vinegar. So, the formula is HC2H3O2. So, there's one hydrogen, two carbons, three hydrogens, and two oxygens. Now, let's learn about the Lewis dot structure of acetic acid or vinegar. So, the Lewis dot structure is H H C H C O O H. So there's four hydrogens, like over here, three hydrogens and one hydrogen, and there's two oxygens, and there's also two carbons. Now we know.
know about the chemical name of baking soda and the chemical name of vinegar, I know about the chemical, the formula of baking soda and vinegar and the Lewis dot structure of baking soda and vinegar. Now, let's look at the formula for the chemical reactions. So, when I pour the baking soda into the vinegar, it formed carbonic acid or H2CO3. And carbonic acid or H2CO3 is unstable. So it decomposed into water and carbon dioxide. Now we know about the formula for the chemical reactions. Now let's learn about the bond structure. So here is H to CO3 and this is H to CO3. Now we're going to learn how H to CO3 decomposes. This is H to CO3, same as over here, or carbonic acid, and H to CO3 is an unstable compound, so it decomposes into carbon dioxide and water. And carbon dioxide is a gas and water is a liquid. So carbon dioxide gas filled up the balloon. So the carbon dioxide in the volcano experiment was trapped inside the dishwashing soap and created bubbles. Now we know about the chemical name of baking soda and vinegar and know about the formula of baking soda and vinegar and the Lewis structure for baking soda and vinegar. And we also learned about the formula for the chemical reactions and we also learned how H2CO3 or carbonic acid decomposes into water and carbon dioxide. Now we know about the chemical reactions of the volcano experiment and the balloon inflating experiment. I hope you liked this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for more fun science experiments. See you next time. Bye.